I messed up everything. You know, it wouldn't be so bad if it were just me, but I ruined Luis Miguel's life. Luis is being sentenced to death because of me. Okay, you have to stop. Seriously. You know, beating yourself up, it, it's not going to help anything, okay? Well, you know what? It's the truth. I mean, the blackmailer told me to stay away from Ethan, but I disobeyed him and, went, and I ended up, like, sleeping with him, Whitney. Somehow, the blackmailer found out, and that's why Luis Miguel's trials were moved up. That's why Ethan didn't have a chance to defend them in court. I'm sorry, honey. I, I wish I really knew what to say here. I just... I don't want you to hate me. Of course I don't hate you, honey. I just want you to be safe. I want you to be okay. I want you to try to stay away from Ethan, honey. No, me too. I'm trying. I try. I just... I, I can't do it. I can't resist him. Well, this isn't exactly the first time you've given in to temptation, okay? You... Oh, it's the first time that my brother's futures were at stake, and what, what, I'm back at it again. I just, I can't. I can't stay away from him, Whitney, no matter what. I just can't. Okay, just try to keep it together, all right? I'm trying. No, he, but he did. He, he even made a, he made a good point. I mean, he said that the blackmailer has done his work. So, so now we should fight the blackmailer together. Wait a second. We don't know that this is the worst that the blackmailer can do, all right? And, and even if Ethan is right... What about the not-so-small detail of your husband, Teresa? No, no, Jared. No. Yes, Jared. What did you say to him on the phone just now? Uh, he, he was just... Uh, was, he was telling me that he wanted to be with me, you know? God, you know I feel terrible about cheating on him. What do well, I do? not terribly enough, apparently. Well, I, 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 look, I, I, I care about him. I do, I do. But it's Ethan I love. You know that. You know what? Ethan is right. I think there's only one thing to do. I think I just need to tell Jared that I don't want to be with him. I think that Ethan and I should just go public with our relationship and we should find this creep who's blackmailing us and, and bring him down. Okay. Are you sure this is what you want to do, though? Yeah. I mean, I love Ethan with all of my heart and soul. And honestly, I can't let him go, no matter how hard I try. I'm going to be straight with Fox. It's going to be tough, but it's the right thing to do. I know, but I mean, how do I tell him that I made a mistake when I married him? And that, that I'm in love with the man he thinks tried to kill him? He's dying. You know, and, and no matter what I say or do, Miguel could still spend the rest of his life in jail. Oh, is that going to stop you from loving him? No. But I just, I can't do this to Fox right now. He's just been going through so much, and he... And taking these horrible treatments, and you know what? They may not even prolong his life. And all I know is if I were Fox, I'd want to know the truth. And from what I've seen of the guy, he can handle it. You can't handle this, this, this lie that you've got bottled up inside of you. That's for sure. You can't let your fear hold you in a relationship that's bad for everyone. you got to be brave here. You know, you're right. You're right. I, I can't do this anymore. It's like, it's driving me nuts, so... You're right. I should go tell Fox right now.